As we approach the 50th anniversary of the wreck of the Edmund Fitzgerald, a group in Superior is working to set up a memorial to remember the ship and her crew. Dave Anderson talks to several members of that organization to find out where an official Wisconsin historical marker will be set up in this week's Holding On to History. A bomb cyclone is a low pressure system that gets very powerful very quickly. That was the type of storm that hit the Northland on November 10th, 1975. Superior native Teddy Moronic says the storm hit the South Shore hard. It was horrible weather. Um, my mother and I were living together in our house and my brother had to come over and shovel us out. Kathy Loxo was a young mother worrying about the ships out in Lake Superior caught in 25 foot seas and 50 knot winds. It was storming and I, I just thought of how horrible it must be to, to be waiting for somebody out there. The heavily laden Edmund Fitzgerald was lost in that weather maelstrom which made national news. A freighter carrying a crew of 29 disappeared on Lake Superior during a severe storm last night, and so far, no survivors have been found. Despite the best efforts of the Coast Guard and the Fitz's sister ship, the Arthur M. Anderson, no survivors would be found, and the ship and her crew would become legends of the Great Lakes. Later that night, when his lights went out of sight, came the wreck of the Edmund Fitzgerald. 49 years after the tragedy, Kathy Loxo, Teddy Moronic, and Brianna Fiant have come together to get a Wisconsin historical marker to commemorate the Fitz in Superior, her last port of call. It will pay tribute to the Fitzgerald and her crew, plus the courage of her sister ship for risking that same storm to search for survivors. The bravery of those people on the Arthur Anderson who went back out there after they had been in that storm and they went back out to search for the Fitz. A plaque like this costs $8,000 and will be put up on Barker's Island not far from the superior entry the Fitzgerald left on that fateful day. Brianna Fiant says 2025 will be the year of the Fitz in Superior and the marker will be up by the 50th anniversary. She feels it is important for Superior to remember its role in the Edmund Fitzgerald's legend. Because of the song, I think it is uh, the most well-known famous uh, shipwreck uh, on Lake Superior. It's the Titanic of Lake Superior. Holding on to history in Superior, Dave Anderson, Northern News Now. The group working to set up the memorial plaque calls themselves the Friends of the Fitz. Another active member of the organization is Superior City Councilor Jenny Van Sickle.